period of time that he was on this crime spree, uh, this tendency to try to identify himself as a mass murderer or a serial killer. Shortly after killing Dale Hall, the frenzy shows... Alright, and it is up, guys. So, I'm getting, uh, about to get ready. I'm gonna go head off to the bank to cash a check. And then I am possibly heading over to Walmart to look at new vlogging cameras. Because the only camera that I got, as you guys know, or at least some of you guys know, is the iPhone that I'm vlogging with now. So, I don't really want to use this as my full-time camera for multiple reasons. So, that's what I'm going to do. So, yeah, let me get dressed. I'm probably uh, going to be looking at uh not like really cheap but um inexpensive point and shoots probably like a Sanyo or uh really don't want to get a Vividor because Vividors they're they're okay for like the first couple weeks uh or a month and then after that you start to see some major problems. I mean that's with my experience. I've had a couple of Vividor cameras in my past, and that's what they end up doing to me. So I'm probably gonna steer away from Vividors, but we'll have to see what cameras they got over there if we head over, decide to head over there. Not too sure yet if that's what's happening. I know at least I'm going over to the bank. So they gotta pay for my phone bill. So, yes. So, I'm just putting my belt on right now. Yes, I know, I put my belt on uh, before I put my jeans on. I've always done it that way. I have my own technique. Oh, wow. No wonder why it was whacked and weird. The freaking thing got twisted. Easy fix. Easy fix. Okay, fixed. I forgot to say that because it was going through my, like, the loops of my jeans. But, like, when it got to the end, it was, like, acted like there was none left to, like, loop. I was like, what? I realized it was, like, twisted. Yeah, I usually with pajama bottoms, I usually wear those like twice a night, or uh, twice a night, it doesn't even make any sense, um, two nights in a row, if they don't become dirty, stained, and if they do become dirty or stained before that, then obviously I'll wear a different pair, but... Pretty much the only clothes that um, I change daily are my t-shirt and my underwear and my socks. I don't change my jeans every day because they're a different fabric. So, you know, they're more durable, they can handle more. T-shirts, obviously, they're on your, you know, torso bare. So, you know, any sweat that accumulates, it's going to soak right up. And I sweat on a daily basis. This Ramon shirt I'm wearing has small holes and a slice of Swiss cheese. It's funny. But anyway, uh, I just got dressed. Well, got my jeans on now. I'm going to put my hoodie on and uh, head upstairs. Going to be rocking the talent hoodie as always. <coughs> My hat's probably going to fall off now, watch. Oh wow, it actually stood there that time. I'd wear my new leather jacket, but it's really not that cold out today. It's actually like almost 40 degrees out. And that's really fucking warm for February here in Vermont. It's funny, I'll show you when we go outside. 
there's a huge ass puddle in front of my lawn. It's uh, yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty cool looking. So, it's not too bright out, so I don't need sunglasses, but I don't want to stay. So I'm all ready. Got my hoodie and my jeans on. So see you guys upstairs. So that's the puddle I was talking about right there. It's pretty fucking massive, if you ask me. It's pretty deep over here as well. So right there, that's probably about a quarter of a foot deep. Yeah, most of the snow is pretty much melted. We didn't really have uh, that much of a winter. It maybe snowed like, uh, I'd say a total of a couple of feet total of this whole entire winter. Winter's almost done too. It's like, uh, yeah, we're in like obviously the first week of February, so yeah, it's so our winter's almost over. We got like this whole month, and then uh, possibly like half a month to a, another full month, and then it's gonna start warming back up again. Freaking Vermont. <laughs> Alright, so, just got done doing my transaction at the bank, now we're heading over to Walmart. Here we go! Uh, you Walmart, we're here at Walmart. Sure? Put you guys in there, guys. It's, uh, I'm done at Walmart, almost home. All my stuff is right there in the bag. I'll show you guys when we get home. But yeah. Yeah, we're like not even a minute away. So, home now. Oh, obviously you guys know, I don't even really know why I just said that, but I'm about to take this bike. The bike. I'm gonna go meet up with Ralph. So, here we go. On the road again. Uh, so what's up guys? Um, we pretty much went around town. We went to the store real quick to, um, I don't know, to get some hopes. And then we decided to just make a huge detour back to the house. Because, uh, no, not nothing to do, but we didn't want to go home straight away. So, Ralph and I decided to come back here for the evening, hang out, play some video games. Play some GTA currently. I'm about to edit yesterday's video. So yeah, turned out to be one of those evenings. It's not too bad, but yeah, um, I found out though about my camera, the one that I bought today, that it had a piece that I didn't see before that I could screw onto the tripod so I could use the camera. Uh, here's the tripod, the new tripod I got. It's the one where it's all terrain. We can like go anywhere, and uh, so. Um, I would keep the camera, but, um, and then when I, oh, did a test video, a test clip, and I imported it into my computer to look at it, the quality of the picture, literally, maybe a little bit better than, uh, like one of those old school flip phones on those cameras, so I'm not about to downgrade dramatically like that. So, I'm going back to the store tomorrow, uh, Walmart, and I'm going to buy the first camera that I had in my hands. I was so stupid, I don't know why I didn't do that. 
I, I got mad at myself earlier, so it's all good. I'll just figure it out tomorrow. Bag's right there. Right there. It has a receipt in it and everything, so I'm going to return it. Um, I'm most likely able to get a ride back there tomorrow. So, uh, with that being said, I'm going to take care of the Walmart shit tomorrow. And then Friday, I'm going to talent and doing some video quality work. So, I can't wait. Pretty pumped about it. So, yeah, this week turned out to be quite a good week. Alright, so uh, I just got done editing and uploading yesterday's video. So, go check it out. Uh, yeah, pretty much it. Oh, yeah, I also want to show you guys this. Dun, 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 dun. My new camera setup. So, this is the tripod and everything. My new tripod. Awesome, awesome. And the camera. But this isn't the camera that I bought today. This is uh, my old, old camera. The old blue one, which is completely retired. So, I'm just using it right now to see uh, what it would be like for tomorrow when I get my new camera. Because the camera that I'm getting tomorrow is pretty much the same size and weight as this camera. So, what I wanted to do was I wanted... I like screwed in the tripod to this camera to get like a tester to see what it'd be like and it is fucking badass i cannot wait for my new camera tomorrow but yeah that's my new setup um it's gonna be official tomorrow when i get the camera but yeah guys I'm still playing some gta Alright, so Ralph has gone home for the night, and uh, I'm turning off my computer for the day. So, yeah, that wraps up today's video. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new for the latest content. I post daily. Well, almost. Uh, click like if you enjoyed. Let me know. And uh, I will see you guys in the next video. Till then, I'm going to bed. So, anyways. Peace out, guys. Stay awesome.